Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Path of Exile. My name is Wilfred and I'm playing a dualist 98, very very close to 90, uh, 2 more percent. So if I don't do anything stupid in the next map or two, uh, I shall be able to reach 90 and that's my goal really because this game is really really hard. Um, anything beyond 90 is, I don't know, it's really like bonus. Um, so I, I've got quite a lot of friends uh, from Marvel Heroes wanted to try out Path of Exile, you know, do have an open mind and I hope you enjoyed as well. Any questions, just drop me here. And also uh, at the description of the video, I share with you the link to my profile in Path of Exile, just in case you'd like to uh, just reference to what I've done in, in this character and this build, the gear. Uh, I didn't invent it myself. I actually re referred to a Matthew's guy, you know, there are, there are quite a lot of guys out there uh, that will help your journey a lot better. So now I am going to, uh, I mean, I, I'm just going to do some like tier 10 map and so on. Nothing too dramatic right now because right now, because it is uh, rather, uh, you know, I'm so close. I'm not going to risk it too much. Um, although I, if I do a bridge, I probably would get a better result out of it. But I'm just going to take it easy and uh, just a little bit cautious, uh, not going to lose my XP over that. Yeah, that's about it. I've been doing uh, quite a lot of like, um, you know, um, tier 10 kind of maps so on and so forth if it, it kind of like you know if I have it so this map I kind of like in a sense um, this map I kind of like it's a lot of um, very interesting layout we just go around it this bloodline by the way just go a little bit cautious here where <laughs> now where is my uh, yeah. So usually I go the outer rim first, um, then I, I saw sort of like, then I'll go back to the middle. I mean, that's usually how I roll here. I am just taking it easy right now, pour some flask. If I need to, whoa, that, you see what I mean? <laughs> if that was to like, uh, I don't know what happened just now, uh, but, but uh, that could have been ended really badly uh, in some sense. Yeah, just a bit cautious here. I'm not going to take risks here, like I said before. Um, yeah. Okay. My heart is beating really hard, fast right now. I mean, I've played this game for quite some time. I really have to say that, uh, you know, this game is very, very exciting, uh, especially some of this area. It's actually very very exciting right now. My heart is beating really fast. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna lie. Like you know, this is a very very exciting game, right? You know, because every death means so much. Uh, it's really painful. All the uh, all the progress being wiped off if you make any mistake, just some mistake, you know, something that you fail to notice and so on. That's it. You know, uh, you have to all, do it all over again. So I'm just going to take it easy here. Um. Uh, whatever, right? Um. Yeah! So, yep, yeah, I've got like a <laughs> level 90. Yay! I'm so happy, man. Wow, finally I've done it. Now I can do something crazy. Now I don't need to worry about anything because I, I don't think I'll ever be wanting to uh, get to 100. That is like, you know. <laughs> it's not something I want to do. Um, I just want to really experience the game, like um, like put some really tough kind of like uh, affixes to the map and be good at it. It would be my goal. Uh, that is something I would like to do. Now I can go crazy, seriously. Ha! Man, I've been waiting for this moment for a very long time because previously, previously I played rather recklessly or you know brave in some sense. Uh, you can check out my video previously. But, uh, you know, when you die a couple of times and you lose so much progress, you kind of like getting a little bit more concerned, a bit worried, like, you know, what you can do, what you should not do, kind of thing. And uh, by the way, in this game, right, it's not like other ARPG where by level means uh, you're stronger. You know, when you, get when you get to the next level, I mean, it's your gear and, you know, at a high level like this, it's very much your gear that determines um, determine how strong you are this uh, level doesn't really matter I mean this is uh, what content this is uh, like uh, level 77 content I'm 90 right so you know, by right it should be a walk in the park you know but it, you know I think most of the time it is walk in the park but um, 
but there are actual moments that are rather scary. Like, you know, it was just sudden death. Like, oops, I forgot to, to look into the, uh, you know, whatever that, that hits me and stuff like that. And yeah, that's that. So now this is the one that I really like this map a lot, you know, this uh, little bit of like... Wow, there's a lot of like endurance, this guy. Yeah, so usually I'll stay inside when there's, um, there's a lot of firestorm outside, so I stay inside the tent. Uh, rather than going out. So I, let me tell you a story, right? So I've got like, um, I was leveling 98, uh, just like right now, but I was like somewhere there. And I was doing this map, um, and I at 98 I died three times already. So, you know, a lot of my progress being wiped off um, here and there. Um, and and unknowingly, I picked a, a fixed map, a fixed map by the, you know, the, the mobs shoot I think three more projectiles, two or three more. I thought, well, you know, that shouldn't hurt. But then there, there was a lot of like the mob that looks like a tower that, that shoot a lot of fire. And goodness me, there were like a whole bunch of them, uh, maybe like, you know, maybe five or six of them. And they were like raining all the fire outside. I couldn't even get out. The moment I get out, my health dropped, like, you know, just get to very low. But then, um, and now I have to deal with the boss as well. But that was really one of the most epic fight that I've, um, I've, I've fought in my, Marvel Heroes in uh, in part of Exile so far, um, it's, it's really really exciting. That fight itself, I mean, I survived. I, I wish I had it on video, but yeah, I mean, this is one of those things that um, really make you. It's very memorable. All this all this fight that uh, that you have survived, those things that you do, you've done well, and so on. Um, yeah, I mean, looking back. Looking back, I was, you know, I, I was a little bit concerned that I wasn't able to get to 90 because I would up, run out of content to, to play. So I don't know whether you noticed or not. Uh, so far, have I looted any map? I don't think I did loot any map. So now you need to spend one map to to play a map. So, you know, there will, there will come... Bend your ear for a moment. <laughs> there will come a point in time whereby... Um, wait, hang on a sec. Let me just clear all these things first. So there will become a point in time whereby you'll be out of uh, maps to play. So these are the maps, by the way, like Danger Room in Marvel Heroes. So sometimes you may come a point in time whereby you're out of map to play and after that you've got nothing to play. Um, so I, fortunately, because I'm using League Stone, um, I, I, I'm still able to get maps to play. And all these maps, right, tier 10 or 9, uh, they are, I, I actually recorded all the progress. Uh, there is about only about 2 to 3%. I mean, it doesn't matter whether tier 8, 9, or 10 uh, is only about 2% progress. So can you imagine how, how slow it is to, to get to, a, to, get to the full bar, especially if you get defeated, you know, mistake may come by here and there. Um, only when there is a Zana inside or when there's, you know, if you do a bridge, then you do a little bit more, like, you know, instead of 3%, you get 5%, um, yeah, or, or even 7%. So, I mean, with Zana, you, you get quite a fair bit, like 7%, so yeah. I mean, these are the things that I've learned. Um, so this uh, is a master. You have beat him. <laughs> it's one of the easiest, uh, you know, thing to do. You just beat the guy up. Yeah, and got I got to also learn that some mobs are really terrible for for even melee. Uh, those that shoot, I think it's a chaos damage. Maybe uh, I don't really have a lot of chaos uh, resistance. So those those hurt a lot, and I also realized that those man, I <laughs> yeah, these are the one that I'm talking about. You know, if if they have a bunch of them, sometimes it hurts a lot. Um, yeah, yeah, and I realized that the the hardest one was the, uh, the was the worm from the from the uh, from one of the dungeon, like a cell or or prison cell kind of thing. It's like a worm that come off the ground, and one bite is like. I'm almost dead out there. You know, it's really crazy. This game, a lot of like, um, you know, kind of pitfall here and there. So yeah, I mean that is all. Re oh, I've got more than fifty monsters. So I, by right, I should be like farming around and see where are the, um, where are the mobs and stuff like that. Man, I'm I'm so overjoyed right now. I I'm not even, 
I mean, I should be paying attention to where are all the mobs are, but I was just like going in random, uh, whatever that sea I destroyed kind of thing. Um, yeah, so the map says that there are more than 50 monsters, um, and, and rightly so, there should be a quite a fair bit. And uh, okay, so what I what am I going to do after this, right? Because I think a lot of you started to ask me, since that now I'm so close to 90, or you know, now I'm at 90, uh, what will I be doing? Uh, will I... Will I you know, like I, I think a lot of people playing Path of Exile in a league, they will start another character that may be more fun to play, um, or, or or so right because that's that's what you usually do. You get all the resources and then you you do it. But uh, to be very honest, all my resources I just invest into one character, which is the ice ice um, you know the Slayer ice crush Slayer. So I'm I'm not really having a lot of other resources here and there. Um, and, um, and and this is really what I have. So I am going to continue playing the Ice Cross Slayer. There are still aspects of the game which I haven't quite um, finished, like the Uber Lab is something I would like to do so that I could, you know, in my in my um, you know uh, ascendancy, I could get this point as well. I think it will help a lot if I get to this uh, this this uh, brutal favor, you know, in in a sense. So. So that's one thing. I mean, I, I think I could have wiped this pot two point and add, have this two point here, you know, using the orbs and so on. But uh, yeah, I mean, that's something I probably would like to do. Another thing I'd like to do is the Queen of the Veil. Vale. Um, it's, uh, I read it's very interesting mechanic. Probably I'll do a normal version just to get the mechanic, like, you know, how to tackle the bosses. And if I got some of those on, on, on YouTube, I'll share with you as well. And I'd like to do a bit of the tier 11 maps because I've been doing a lot of tier 8, 9, 10, um, it, 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 I mean, it's fun, but uh, after a while, it's just something like this one. So I, I don't really get to, you know, uh, do, do something crazy. So I'd like to do that as well. I'd like to try a lot of this stone. And also last but not least, of course, I'd like to uh, finish off some of the challenges I have. I mean, I'm, I'm now at 16, I think, some of which can quite easily done, like the craft, master craft, all these things. I think I can, I can do it, you know, just back to the hideout itself. Uh, Veil bosses, I need to research a little bit on how to find some of these, <laughs> these mobs and so on. Um, and, and I think I'll, if I use the invader, kind of like a least stone, probably I can do a bit more here. Uh, but uh, I mean, still 24 is quite far. The, uh, the, I just need to kill a rogue exile holding a talisman. I think I should be able to do it. The, uh, I'll go and <laughs> destroy Malachi. I think I can, right? I mean, now 90. Um, and uh, I think slowly as I play, I think one of the gems should be up to 20. So like some of this gem here. Yeah, actually it's quite close. Look at this one. Just a little bit more, I'll get to this this one as well. So, you know, if I can do overlap, then I'll finish this one. So in short, I, I do a bit of beyond. So it's still quite a fair bit to do uh, with my character and I'll continue to do that. And I hope you enjoy your Legacy League as well. Um, Man, I'm so pleased because now I don't even need to worry about dying anymore. I'm immortal. Yay. Yeah, this is a good feeling. Okay, thank you very much for watching. Bye.